I got a question. Did, uh, did you help me put the hog on? No, I didn't. I didn't even know he put the hog on. He put the hog on and I didn't even know. But you're the host. I'm the host. He's Watch the world the champion. Host. World champions do stuff, I guess, that you don't know they're doing. That's how they're going. You don't put the hog on. Now, what happened was. <laughs> Stay tuned because you never know what's going to happen when my friend Marcio comes to town. Wink, wink. <laughs> Smoke house by you. You ain't never had Smoke house by you. Hey guys, on this episode, we're at Smokehouse Bayou headquarters. I've got Marcio Borgazon, a good buddy of mine. He's a current world champion, whole hog from Memphis in May. And I got Ted Dinkins representing two brothers out of Starkville, Mississippi. We're here at headquarters in Gilbertown, Alabama. We're doing a whole hog. Y'all are gonna enjoy this, so hang around for this episode. It's gonna be fun. Get ready. Well, Marcio just pulled up. Let's get this party started. Gilbert Town, what's up? <laughs> we are home, baby. That's right. Sweet you ready to smoke a hog? Sweet home Alabama, we're ready, baby. That sounds good. We got Marcio set up beside headquarters. Then the word got out. He was in town. Celebrity, and I had to stop by a smokehouse by you. Hey Eric, Marcio's back in town. Man, he moves pretty good for a big boy. Well, let's get started. Right, Marcio, what are you, uh, what are you injecting this hog? Uh, with? This is just a little blend of brown sugar and uh, salt, and, and uh, we got apple juice in there. Okay. Just a little something to get it a little, just a little, little love in it, you know. Marcio's injection has about 18 ingredients in it, but we don't expect him to tell this it to us, love. do we? This is just love. My assistant, right here. Mr. William. Mr. WD-40. Come on now. I was just joking, cousin. Look, look now, you done made my feelings hurt. <laughs> you done hurt my feelings. You done messed up, hey, hey Ron. <laughs> Come on. I, I bet cousin don't know what that means. Look, don't put that on Facebook. <laughs> Getting close to the bottom, Dad. We're going to let them rest a little bit and then we'll come back. And okay, so we need that other plastic. Yeah, she took it, huh, didn't she? No, it's right here. Oh. Now, as you can tell, this is not a really an instructional video. This is just a great behind the scenes, friends hanging out, getting together, doing a whole hog. So I do hope you enjoy this. Well, we got those butts coming. Hey, Brian, how you doing today? I'm doing great, Marcio. Well, I'm doing fun too. <laughs> Marcio and Catfish are covering this hog because it's still warm here and uh, we just want to make sure the flies don't get on it. All right, this is your secret rub, huh? This is our hog addiction blend. Uh, we love this stuff right here. It's mixing house right now, and you may see a few clumps of, of brown sugar, you know, because you got to have a little brown sugar in the brand. Oh, yeah, brown sugar, cayenne pepper, and garlic make the world go round that's, that's in the it. south, That's baby. all it is in this rub right here. That's it. You can't be telling all my secrets like that, Brian. Oh, okay. Hey, I like my new hat. Look, yeah, you can go to, uh, to to smokehousebayou.com and place your order in one of those cool hats right here. I was gifted this one and I didn't mean to make y'all jealous, but go <laughs> order you one. Brian will take care of you. I'm sure he'll get some kind of uh, hog addiction discount there tapped to that. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see how this hog turns out first. Let's, let's just see how the... <laughs> Before we start issuing discounts. We're not using this kind of <laughs> Sorry guys, uh, we apologize for the uh, inconvenience on the discount right now. We're, our website's under maintenance. All right, Marcio, tell me a little bit about your method going on right here. Oh, so, uh, you know, we got a, we got a 120 pound hog. We're expecting a little more people. So 
what I'm doing here, I'm adding a few pork butts to the cavity, and uh, we'll cook we'll cook them, and that'll that'll give us another uh, 50 to 60 uh, portions right. right here. I just want to get rid of some of this fat because it we don't need that much fat in here. Fat is good, but you know we don't have all of that. All right, so you just gonna set them. I'm gonna set them in. butts right in the cavity right there. Huh? Just gotta let them cook in there, and uh, they gonna be phenomenal. We already got some of the rub. Now, does that help also, like, insulate those ribs a little bit or something where it, they kind of cook the same? Not really. I mean, it does, yes, but no, for zero purpose, those ribs are going to overcook. Yeah. By the time, you know. Right. There's no way to keep them. Um, that's part of the money muscle right there. Yeah. As you can see, that different uh, texture on the meat right there. Hey, have you ever smoked a whole hog? Tell us about it in the comments. Catfish. Tell, tell me what you want. You can't give me what I want. Well, <laughs> I know you didn't. <laughs> Set you up for that. You getting that pit ready there, Marcio? Excuse me. Is my new hat crooked? Looks good. There you go. Here's a secret. You want that pretty, pretty cherry color? Get that B and B. Right. That's right. B &B. Fast charcoal in the business. Bro. Now I'm not sponsored by B and B, but I can tell you this: I use their wood at our headquarters every what day. What other wood will you use, Marshall? I have some uh, some pecan over there. No. Uh -huh. You from some, Georgia or something? I've got some pecan, pecan, and some <laughs> picking wood. You feel me? I want you to put some of that popcorn wood on there so it'll be buttery tasting. Now, in the chicken, yes, I like to use a little popcorn because it gives that buttery flavor. <laughs> Y'all try that at home. <laughs> try it. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> it was at this time, somehow, I got distracted and Marcio put the hog on. As you can tell, I don't have any footage of that. Dressing room, makeup? Yes, to the lady, uh, I mean, to the room, to the makeup room. Oh, this, oh they took our sign now. It's the uh, VIP room. Oh, I got you. Yes, sir. Wow, How about that, that didn't take long. <laughs> that didn't take long at all. Well, the hog's on. Let's enjoy the afternoon. All right, so we're going to do a little ribbon cut here in about an hour. Awesome. So we brought nice out the red carpet for you. We got the mayor, the council, <laughs> all the VIPs. Look, so. I'm just glad that the border y'all let me through. See, Brian said that I'd, I'd, I'd have to come to the Chalk County border and drop my trailer off. Right. And y'all would come take it. There would have to be an inspection done. And then, <laughs> so I'm you glad y'all let me through that. Oh, we're pretty easy going, man. Okay, we'll, we'll try, as long as you bring in good food. Look, so check this, check this out, here. Nick. Watch that smoke. Brian's cousin is just laying in there. <laughs> man, that, that looks, that is a real deal. So you need to come back tomorrow and see the finished product, huh? So this will cook for how long? It'll cook for about 20 hours. Man, I can't wait. I was about to say, you can literally smell it when you're rounding the, you know, the bin here coming about to make a turn. Anyway, it's going to be awesome night. Are you video with Brian? I am, man. It's going on YouTube. Oh, on YouTube, by the way. Hey, it's okay. I need you to sign a disclaimer. That's all right. That's all right. I didn't know if you was taking a picture of what, but no, it's, this is going to be awesome. But uh, Well, thanks for coming and doing the ribbon cut. Oh, no problem. Me. Like I said, I'm glad we could yeah. make, make it, it happen. Yeah. Yeah. I'm make sorry it. that, we you know, everything's been kind of crazy this year, but it's hey, we're going we to get it. We're going to get it back rolling. Keep 20 gifts on giving, and we're going to keep receiving. Let's see what Marcio and Ted's got cooking. All right, Marcio, y'all tell us, hey. you and Ted, tell us what we got Ted, going on right here. What, do you, what did you bring for us here, Ted? Well, what tell I brought us, you is I brought you a prime strip, okay? And so what Marcio has done is he has tied this up and he's seasoned it and he is going to do a reverse sear. So, you know, one of the methods that a lot of times is important you know, to explain to our, our viewers is why we tie. So when we got this, it was about that flat, you know. So when you tie, you bring into a more of a consistency round piece of meat. So what that's going to do is going to develop consistency as you cook. All the way so, through the center. All the way through the center. So what we're going to do, we're going to smoke it here. We say about to 120, slow. Yes. So when, when I get to 120, we're going to take it to a hot fire and we're going to get this fat 
a nice char color. And so when it's up, up, up to a 137, we'll take it out, wrap it, let it rest for about 30 minutes. Cut and it up and eat it. Yeah, that guys, sounds good. Guys, let me tell you, it's going to be nice. Stay tuned. Hey, and look, we can't have a party at Smokehouse Bayou headquarters without me smoking a little jerky, so we got some jerky going too. I'm about to take this off. This is smoked pecan, it's hit temp, and it is coming off and it's gonna join the party as well. Man, shortly after that, our guest of honor showed up, David Kim, he's from Southern California, AKA Bubba Woo. And Bubba Woo flew in with his friend or his business associate, Tony Farrell, met Marcio for the first time, I tell you what, I can't say enough about David. We've grown to be brothers over the years, and he is laser focused on helping veterans and many other people. So, looking forward to a lot of adventures with Bubba Woo. We also accomplished our ribbon cutting for Smokehouse Bayou headquarters. Thank you for the people that came out, the residents, the Chamber of Commerce, the, the paper, all of our friends that showed up. It was awesome much appreciated hey we also want to thank my lifelong friend Chris Graham for providing some awesome live music tonight uh, it meant a lot to us thank you Chris hey y'all remember the prime strip that Mr. Ted brought well it's time to sear that thing man it is off the smoker check this out this guy well he's one of those who knows that life is just a leap of faith spread your arms Marcio started slicing up that prime strip and hey the night got even better don't mind if I do the cameraman's got to eat <laughs> Come on over here, for real. Starving you. <laughs> you know in life how you have those great nights with your friends that you'll never forget? This is one of those nights. Hey man, we got Bubba Woo on the stage with Chris. You don't dare make a stand. Marcia, why do you why are you doing that? I do it because I love. I do it because it's a hog. It's addiction. a hog, but what does that do? Actually? It's a hog addiction. Oh, what this too, yeah. Oh, this is just bringing moisture. You see how like yes. a lot of that meat's dry. Look when yep. you touch it with that. It, it's making love with that meat. Wow. And what's in there? Water. This is uh, yeah, this got a little bit of gasoline in it, and then I put a little bit. <laughs> uh, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Baby. You wrapping the baby? Oh, Marcio no, no, no. wrapped the baby, Dr. put him to bed, and we just enjoyed a little more fellowship. Marcio, you look like you just making yourself right at home here in Gilbert Town, man. Is well, this? Hey, Brian, good morning. Is this your next new? Home place, maybe. This, well, this is my my little area here that was given to me for this weekend. You know. <laughs> it looks nice. Got your flags up. Yes, sir. How's that hog looking? He's in there. Uh, he's all tucked in. I'd love to show y'all what it looks like, but we uh, we got him around a little blanket, and so he uh, he's gonna be a little Reynolds in. wrap blanket. Reynolds wrap. Yep. And right. So he's just there snugly tight, but I can show you if you come over here, you know, we're gonna be around here Probably gonna start serving around one So y'all need to just hurry up and come on down because there's a big line of folks that called us already So it's gonna chop, be a chop. fun day. 
Yes, Fun sir. day. All right, brother. We'll see them about 12 or 1 o'clock. No, you say 1 o'clock? That hog will be ready about 1 o'clock? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 10 4. Be good in timber. All right, buddy. I'll let you get back to your housekeeping. Hey, y'all excuse me for a second. <laughs> Can you hear? Oh. Hold on. Hello. Yeah? They're in there. He's in there. I said, just a minute. He's in there. Come on. So what you doing, Marcio? Well, right now we're putting a little glaze on them. We're gonna make them look really pretty. Look at it. Uh-huh. Looks like he's just been down to the beach for a week. Yep. Put a little all glaze tan. on them. Been all tinned up. Now, I know that Ron Mason actually smoked this hog. Ron but he's did. shy to be on camera, so he has Marcio, Marcio do the camera work. Man, that thing is looking pretty. <laughs> now look, you can garnish a hog with a lot of things, but we decided to do it with collard greens. That's the best. <laughs> Marcio. Yes, sir. A gallon of the infusion? Mm -hmm. Wow. That infusion. I think that infusion is... Can you feel it? Can you feel the infusion? No, you gotta taste it. I mean, try the infusion. It's unbelievable. Can you feel it? Or taste it or feel it? Taste it and feel it. I mean, you gotta taste it and feel it. Yeah. So, Marcio, basically, it took you about 22 minutes to smoke this, right? Is that right? Yes, basically. Basically. It was basically the time we used. Basically, what kind of hog is you? Are you basically smoking? Basically, a whole one. A whole one. <laughs> <laughs> he's sticking his tongue out at catfish. That's what he's doing. Where's catfish? Marcio oh, did a great job catfish. on this hog. Hey, thanks for catfish watching this video, awesome. man. It was a special time for all of us. You know, at the end of the day, barbecue isn't about flavor. It isn't about competitions. It isn't about anything except people sitting around a fire together, enjoying each other's company, people you love and respect as you do this thing called life together. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and we have hope you have a great 2021. God bless you. And please hit that subscribe button, man. It helps uh, support our channel. And check us out at smokehousebayou.com. We'd love to send you some world-class jerky, sauces, rubs, marinades crackers and coming soon a smokehouse by you coffee y'all have a great night